Hey guys, quick question. When you go to pick up your favorite skincare product, hair care product, or even makeup, do you bother to look at the ingredients list? Do you know what you're looking for in terms of like effectiveness and um, maybe harmful ingredients, certain things to stay away from? Well, one ingredient I want to talk to you about, in my humble opinion, to stay away from is parabens. And I know you've seen parabens before. I know you've probably heard of it before. And generally, it comes at the end of the ingredients list. And you'll see them in the form of isoparaben, methylparaben, butylparaben, or just regular paraben. Paraben is parahydroxybenzoates, or is an ester of a parahydroxybenzoic acid. That long word is basically saying that it's a preservative. And what it is, they put this preservative in liquid formulations to uh, stop microbial growth. So this way you have a very long shelf life. And that's wonderful. This is something that they figured out they did back in the 50s and they started putting this stuff um, in products so they can make mass amounts of it so it can sit on the shelves for a long period of time. That's great. But the one thing that is not great is that it has been linked to um, hormone disruptors, possible cancers. Studies have shown that they have actually seen parabens in the breast tissue of women with breast cancer. These parabens, what they do, they mimic estrogens and then they attach themselves onto the um, receptor cells of the est of actual estrogen. And it causes all kinds of havoc into the body, anywhere from allergies to, to skin irritations to something as very serious as cancer. So it's something that you definitely want to look for in your product, in my humble opinion. Now, am I saying go upstairs in your cabinet and just throw everything out that has a paraben in it? Because I'm going to tell you, you will probably end up throwing everything out. Now, I'm not saying that, but if you want to, you can, okay? But what I am saying is the next time when you go out to purchase something, whether you're looking online or you're out at a store, you know, take a minute, look at the ingredients list, and you may want to replace whatever it is that you have that you see that has a paraben in it and replace it with something that um, is a lot less caustic, okay? So that is um, my PSA for today, my public service announcement, and um, I want you guys to have a good day, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.